Jeremy, it's that time of the season where, as you get ready for uh, the next game and for regular season, you start upping your minutes. Are you looking forward to maybe a little bit more than 45 in tomorrow's game? Yeah, definitely. I think uh, that's the best way to to get match fitness is to play games, and you know it's nice to play against an opponent and kick somebody else rather than your teammates. So, uh, you know, we're looking forward to playing against Orlando City, which is a good team. Um, I think they won the league last year, so a uh, very good team and a good test for us. Is one of the main attributes of this club going into the season going to be its depth? Because you even see today there's a couple of guys missing from training, but there's more than adequate talent throughout the team to fill all the holes. Yeah, most definitely. I think um, the coaching staff uh, did a good job of, um, you know, bringing in players to for guys to compete in different spots. Like I said, in, in this league, you you need um, you need depth. You need guys who are you know, capable of stepping in and, and doing a shift. So um, I think we have that, and um, we're looking forward to the game again. It's a really nice mix between younger players and experienced players, and you yourself are almost moving into that veteran status with the club. And so when you get guys like Jonathan Osorio, I know you worked with him last year, um, but also Manny, are you able to give him a little pointers? And if so, what have you been telling him? Yeah, time's flying by. 60 already, it's crazy. But um, yeah, most definitely. I just want to help out the younger guys, you know, if uh, you know they need help in certain areas or, you know, just being confident and you know the, they're good players um, you know they wouldn't be here if they weren't so um, just you know being there if, if they have any questions or anything but you know we have a good balance and you know like me I'm even looking to the older guys are uh, Stevie Caldwell and you know and Bradley so um, I think it's all over. Now we've seen a bit of a difference in, in training styles from Sarasota here you went from the two days down to one a day is this a time where you really focus on keeping your body uh, maintained and getting that rest that's so uh, desperately needed by professional athletes? Right, I think we're training around our games right now. Um, we're playing Wednesday, Saturday, so you know, um, you know, after a game, we're getting a little bit of recovery, and guys who didn't play a lot are getting a good session in. And you know, we're training hard, and then it's tapering down towards the game. So um, right now, we're trying to get our fitness from uh, our matches, and you know, guys are increasing their minutes each game. It's been an exciting times over in Sochi right now, and I know Canada's two and three in the medal race, and a big game going on uh, after your training this morning. Are you rooting for anyone in particular, or are you just going to kind of sit back and enjoy the games? Definitely going for the U.S. Um, our women, uh, I, w I don't know what happened, but um, you know the Canadian guys were definitely giving us a little bit of banter, so I'm hoping our guys can pull it through today. Excellent. Thank you.